Ljubomír Vucsinics új vidékről érkezett Magyarországra. Káoszt fest. Olyan káoszt, amit tudatosan épít a káosz elméletre és annak egyértelmű geometriai alapjaira. Ezek az alapok a szemünk láttára esnek szét, rendezetlenednek a termodinamika második főtételének regulája szerint. Kisi erőltetetten fogalmazva a kompozíciónak, mivel a spontán alkotói folyamatról, magára hagyott rendszerről, azaz befejezett képről beszélünk, nem csökkenhet az entrópiája. Az informatikai nyelvre fordítva, hiszen egy műalkotás információs felület is egyúttal, az entrópia akkor a legkisebb, nulla, ha a hírforrás, esetünkben az alkotói gesztus, mint médium biztosan és mindig ugyanazt a diszharmóniát sugározza. Éppen ezért a tudomány és a művészet 21. századi kapcsolatairól faggattuk. From Serbia, professor of fine arts and uh, fine artist in Budapest, in the occasion of his uh, exhibition in uh, Bayard Gallery, and uh, directly going in the middle, I just I'm just interested how uh, it came the relationship and the con- contacts in Hungary for you, and when it started uh, your your representation in Hungary? I think uh, that uh, my connections uh, with uh, Hungarian contemporary art uh, is now more than 10 years uh, ago. Uh, First of all, uh, I was uh, represented uh, in Hungary as a graphic artist uh, um, in Miskolc Biennale. Afterwards, uh, I was uh, represented as a Serbian painter uh, in uh, Grafisoft Park, and uh, and uh, the main thing and uh, the the part of uh, my presentation now came uh, when I uh, met uh, very kind and a very good friend of artists uh, here, and uh, and that that was uh, the real connection. Uh, the connection with uh, Bayard Gallery uh, is uh, quite a personal because uh, that is an artist run gallery uh, run by artists uh, that I really appreciate and uh, uh, in, a, in, a, in a field of uh, my expression uh, we are very similar and uh, as uh, we are as a country is uh, nearby uh, that <laughs> that is also kind of a relation uh, as a geographical and cultural relation yeah and you know, uh, I, w- I i want if you speak about a little bit uh, about your your uh, your connection it's a concrete art, but not in the traditional sense that we we can we consider normally concrete art like uh, just a hard edge and abstract yeah. geometric art. But uh, I think that uh, we can say concrete art for the more more expressive art as well because uh, you can find behind uh, some uh, how to see, say some some. Uh, some uh, mathematical connections, some mathematical st- structures, and uh, I know that you started as a ge- geometrical artist and then moved uh, uh, toward the, 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 the informal, the, the, the expressive art. So I want if you if you experiment you. Uh, the main issue of uh, of visibility of my work is in geometric. Uh, if you look at this painting that is behind of me, uh, it, it is in, a, in an expressive manner. Uh, it is made with a lot of expression and uh, in a kind it is colorful and vibrant. But uh, that, that, that is on the, on, the, on the first glance when you saw it. Uh, but uh, if, you, if you try to find it uh, meaning, uh, inner meaning, 
you will find it in geometry. Uh, in, uh, in my uh, artistic practice, uh, I, I have uh, phases uh, when I'm uh, in uh, very concrete art, uh, and that uh, especially when I'm doing uh, something as a digital prints in a, in a graphical uh, in a graphical representation in a large scale projects uh, and uh, uh, one one of uh, those projects uh, was uh, in Novi Sad uh, in uh, exposition it's called Danube Dialogues uh, and that was uh, the dialogue with one uh, among the greatest. Uh, uh, artist who is working on a concrete art, uh, Josef Linschinger uh, from uh, uh, Vienna. And uh, the exposition was uh, Serbian-Austrian dialogue. Uh, he, was, he was, as a great uh, artist, uh, working uh, in, a, in a hard edge geometry, uh, in a silk cream prints. Uh, uh, and, uh, in that time, I was I was working uh, on the digital prints, also in the geometrical forms. But uh, anyhow, I'm always nearby. Uh, it's called concrete art. Uh, but uh, even when I'm working in a harder edge, uh, there there is some kind of a vibration that uh, I I would like to show it. You know, uh, to show it uh, maybe in the first plan. And uh, what about, so, what is your opinion uh, of the, because now we can see, it, it was a very, very big uh, 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 run of uh, figurative art in the late, yeah, we can say, in, from the late 90s until today, but uh, if you see around in Europe, now something is, is, is changing. What, what is your opinion? What is the future of the concrete art uh, in the 21st century? Because I, I, I ask it because I think that due to concrete art, the art and, and, and science come somehow together, not just visually, but in, in, in our mentality. Uh, I think that, uh, as you told, uh, science are out uh, in a very good correlation. Uh, uh, there is no, there is uh, that that is uh, that is a field uh, that is opening, uh, and uh, that field uh, is opening uh, in this twenty-first century. Uh, and it's very interesting bef because uh, the science uh, don't. Uh, recognize the problem that we artists have. Uh, as an artist, uh, we have uh, blank white canvases. And from nothing, we have to create something. And that is, that is very interesting uh, for a science. Because uh, science uh, has a uh, has system that is going through. And uh, we, are, we are not uh, working. We have, we have personal sy systems. Uh, we are we are managing uh, really something from nothing, uh, and uh, that came from our souls. And uh, uh, I think that uh, now the art uh, is uh, speaking uh, about about our feelings. And uh, I have I have some I cannot say bad feeling, but. I don't have so positive feelings uh, for a future of all the world, uh, because uh, a lot uh, there there are two two great uh, ways. Uh, one is economical, and that economical is only on the highest level, and the another one is the technical. And uh, the techniques, uh, as as uh, human were thinking, uh, will create a better world. But uh, much more technical world, we have less time. Uh, so uh, to be an artist uh, in the beginning of the 24th century uh, is a is a is a great uh, great work, uh, and uh, it, it it isn't only uh, so great uh, for a person artist, uh, but it's also great. Uh, uh, for a social structure. Uh, it has uh, more meaning uh, than it has a space. And I think that uh, uh, art in 24, 21st century is going to be in a correlation with science, 
but uh, it needs uh, more place uh, to communicate uh, with uh, not only with the artists, not only with the cognizer, but to communicate with, with common people. Uh, when I think about uh, the art in the 21st century and the correlation of art with the sciences and things like that, uh, I'm thinking that the main issue of the art in the 21st century is cognition. It's uh, not uh, to represent something, uh, not to talk about something. Uh, and what common people are always asking our artists, uh, what is the painting about? It isn't about nothing. It's functioning. And if you know to look, then you can uh, understand the higher meanings. And uh, that, that, that is uh, why, why art was always with the human. What, what is the main, main thing in the art that uh, uh, it's more human than whatever else humans are doing? Uh, whatever else humans are doing, are doing with a kind of purpose. There is no purpose in art, uh, and uh, the art uh, isn't uh, founded to be nice, Mm, you don't. It, it doesn't have to be uh, nice uh, in a, in a commonly speaking uh, words, but uh, it has to transfer uh, higher meanings. Uh, that uh, and to think about uh, uh, through the art uh, that was made even on, on the on the beginning of, of the humans uh, humans as uh, society as uh, as an as in thinking, uh, uh, when man began to think, uh, if you are looking uh, at those art, uh, you can also uh, you can also think about the universe. And the art isn't landscape. The art isn't only portrait. That 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 was uh, in historical period. That was uh, that was something. Uh, it has to be, and afterwards the artists are talking about much more and, and about the high senses and uh, about uh, what, what is uh, sublime. In the, uh, and uh, the science, science doesn't have such a sublime. Uh, art is now correlated, uh, when we are speaking about the science, uh, that the correlation is uh, in uh, physics and in the in, uh, in opinion of, uh, of a nowadays physics.